Terry, I spoke earlier with the Assistant Superintendent of Curriculum Instruction for Lubbock ISD, and before spring break, students from grades 2nd all the way through 12 were given Chromebooks, and they are able to use those to go online and access Google Classroom, where they can turn in assignments. But LISD says they're getting a little bit creative with their curriculum, and their teachers also have YouTube channels to connect with their students. So many of the things you still were going to learn um, in school, we're still learning just in a regular plan. We're just having to be a little bit slower. And then we also took some things that we thought, you know what, we can save that for next fall. As they are adjusting to this new method of learning, LASD says they've switched grading to a pass, incomplete, and exempt format. We're just asking people to take it one step at a time, one day at a time, give themselves a lot of grace in the process. For those students without internet access, LASD now has Park and Learn Wi-Fi stations at their middle and high schools, but is working on a plan to bring internet into students' homes. We'll have hotspots that will go to individual students' individual homes. It's not just an adjustment for the schools but for the parents as well. Pretty good. It was pretty hard though at first. So I commend these teachers for jobs well done and LISD for getting the curriculums, you know, getting everything put together so that these kids can continue on with their education. Nelson says she has four children at home and says teachers are consistently contacting her to check in with student progress. I want them to have as much of school activity as possible. So we literally stop every day and I take them to go get the lunches. We wave at the lunch ladies and thank them and everything and they come back home and eat. Nelson says it's equally as important to keep your kids active while they're staying at home. We do karaoke. They have one of them plays the clarinet, so she plays on her clarinet. They sing, they dance, they flip, they cheer. Now, LASD says they are preparing to return to school on May 4th, according to Governor Abbott. However, LASD says they do have plans in place if children have to do the remainder of the school year online. They just want parents to go easy on themselves and remember to take it one day at a time. Terry.